Hello, beautiful people. Today is Wednesday, December 1st, and that is the subject of this video. The fact that it's December. How, Sway? How is it December already? So, first of all, let's recap. My November was going really well. Yes, I said was. Um, <laughs> Thanksgiving prep totally blew it out the water. Um, I can't blame on Thanksgiving. I think I just was frustrated, honestly, by week three. And um, I slowly started incorporating stuff that was not supposed to be part of November. And I kept up that same energy all the way until the end of November. So I didn't like overdo it, overdo it. There were plenty of times I could have had cake and cupcakes and I didn't. I had ice cream twice. That doesn't sound that great. Um, and I did have meat a few times. Um, so yeah. But I will say that those first few weeks, I think it went work great. The goal was to keep going. But those first few weeks, I think it went great. And so I'm going to keep going and do a no -sember, which is just saying no in December. Um, and I'm going to do another list like I did for November and put it up. And I think I'll put one here too so you guys can kind of see and follow along. Um, and I think I'll put one up here too so you guys can see and follow along with what I'm doing and progress and things. And I think it did help when I was doing, um, I would do a live, I think, the first three nights. Just continual, just doing them. Just to talk through it. And I think that was good accountability for me. So I think I might do something like that again. Probably not every night, but... Maybe like every other night, I'll do a, a live check-in just to touch base with you guys and be accountable. Um, but yeah, I'm hoping to do some of that tonight and have that out by tomorrow. Because I want I want progress. You know, I, I'm tired of starting and stopping. And I did see some positive results, but not enough because of my own inconsistency. So I want to get ahead of that and yeah begin again in November, which I know is not as catchy as November but that's fine that's fine second thing I'm going to talk about in this video is it's December it's December 2021 how in the world now December is actually my second favorite month the first one being June because my birthday and that's just how I feel about birthdays but December is a close second because Jesus birthday the celebration of Jesus birthday and New Year's now I like New Year's because even though and I, I love that our pastor does this he talks about how don't wait for the New Year's to do new things right if you notice an issue change it right away don't wait and be like oh I'll do it for New Year's resolution like no do it in October do it in March do it in May um, but I do love just the excitement and the dressing, like, opportunity to dress up. <laughs> and, um, I, I like a good party. So New Year's Eve has all those things. Um, New Year's Day has all those things. And I like to gather. Anytime that people are more willing to gather together with friends and family is a bonus for me. So I love that. I love being able to see my friends, being able to, you know, just hug the people I love looking forward to that very much um i also get to see my nuclear family in december which is always i just i love them it's a, it's a treat and we have some new additions which is very exciting um oh my goodness it's so exciting so exciting what it's been a it's been a crazy year you guys i mean so much change but i'm very excited to see everybody um and then christmas time i just love like we celebrate jesus year round over here that's just that like Jesus is bomb. January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, December, all year, 24-7, 365. He's just, he's just, he's it, right? So it's not because of Christmas necessarily. However, I have noticed that people are more cheerful, sometimes more friendly, more open, just, and I like that. I like the atmosphere of like, hey guys, like, it's cool. It's the holidays, you know, we're, we're working less, you know, we're, we're doing things we like more, we're out seeing lights. Another thing I like, Christmas lights, so beautiful. 
I feel about Christmas lights the same way I feel about fireworks. They're just gorgeous. I like a good Christmas light display. Uh, it's like, it's like the fireworks of December and I'm here for it. So very excited about that. Gathering with family, spending time, the overall atmosphere of just joy and excitement and camaraderie. Love it all. Um, and then you're just ending out another year. We made it to another end of a year. Like, let me tell you something. People, uh, I, I think from 2020 and then just this year, people die every day. Like, I don't think we have that revelation of that because we, we act like life is so certain and it's really not. Like, I haven't, I mean, yeah. I had a, a colleague who I saw Friday. I saw Friday. I got an email Sunday evening that they passed away. And I'm still in a place of like, what? What? Um, <sighs> but yeah, I am. Um, yeah. I think looking around, I, I get very like, um, introspective and reflective this time of year just looking back on all that's happened this year all that's happened all that's changed all that's still the same those who left those who are still around those who died those who were born like all these different things that happened in this year is yeah i think i just always get into a place of like just reflecting on that and thinking it through and yeah oof so yes, all those reasons. I like December. It came very quickly, but I'm excited that it's here. Um, I'm going to try to be more present at some of these holiday celebrations in the city because I started going in 2019 and then I loved it. Loved it. One of my first Ferris wheel at this Christmas display downtown with my good friend Tia and then they shut down in 2020 so I haven't gone back since and it's back. The Ferris wheel's back. It's lit up. It's beautiful. Um, so I'm looking forward to doing those things this month and then just being with friends and family as much as I can because I love you guys and um, yeah I'm taking some time off work not a whole lot but I'm taking some time off to to sit and to be and to work and to reflect and to spend time with friends and to, to yeah to read and to write and so much so much <laughs> for vacation it sounds pretty busy but but yeah I'm looking forward to this month and oh uh, I'm looking forward to 2022 2021 let me say something I'll, I'm sure I'll reflect on this more near the end of this year but um 2021 was wild it is wild it is a hard time it's a hard time. It's a hard time. There, there were some very. It's been a. It's been a hard season. Twenty twenty one's been a hard season. Um, I would like this season to end. <laughs> I would like to transition into a more easy season, but I don't know if that's gonna be the thing next. So I just want to be more prepared for whatever season's next is. Is where I am now. Um. There's that verse where Jesus says he doesn't pray that trouble leaves, but that his followers are equipped to handle the trouble. And that's, that's where I am. You know, I would love, I would love an easier season. I would love a more relaxed season. I would love a season more marked by open doors and, um, you know, like dreams being fulfilled. But I pray that whatever season comes, I've grown from the last season exponentially not like a little bit but like making strides and moving forward and leaving old stuff behind um and leaving old stuff behind so yes it's December happy December and all right love you guys